Hi guys, I am Jigvinder and in this video we are going to learn how to block websites in Windows 7 without any third party software. I am performing this activity on Windows 7 but you can also perform it on other Windows operating systems like Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 8 or Windows 8.1. Now let's move to our Windows 7 computer to perform this activity. I am on my Windows 7 laptop. To block websites on this computer, we have to edit a file whose name is host to see the location or path of this file. I click on start button and click on computer to open Windows Explorer. Double click on C volume. After this, double click on Windows folder. Search and double click System32 folder. After this, double click on Drivers folder. And in drivers folder, double click on etc subfolder. Here you can see the host file. You can note down the path from the screen. You can edit it in many ways. I show you my preferred method of editing this file. We start with creating a copy of host file. This copy can be used in case original file is corrupted in the process. To create a copy, right click this file. Select copy. And in free space here, right click again and click paste. Administrator privileges are required to paste any new file in this directory or folder. I am login with a user who is also administrator of this laptop. Click on continue. A copy of host file appear in etc folder. Now I drag host file and drop it on my desktop. Confirmation is required to move the file. Click on continue. To edit this file, Right click it and from context menu select open. From the choose the program page select notepad and click ok to open this file in notepad. The host file is open in notepad. This file was used earlier on for name resolution. Nowadays more advanced systems like DNS or domain name system servers are used for name resolution. But Windows OS still reads this file. 127.0.0.1 here represents the local host or this computer. Some IP addresses and respective websites are also given here as examples. But these entries are ignored because they are commented with hash symbol. We are going to make an entry in this file. I select this line, right click it, copy it and paste it here in next line. Here we can type the name of any website which we want to block on this computer. Now let's open some website. I open a web browser for example Google Chrome and in address bar type facebook.com. Home page or login page of Facebook appears in front of you. I select www.facebook.com from address bar. Right click it, copy it and paste it in our host file in place of local host here. Save this file. Here you can enter some more website names. We can use IP addresses like 127.0.0.23 etc. And type names of websites which we want to block on this computer in front of IP addresses. Let's test it for only one website. Save changes and exit from the file. Now drag this file from desktop to its original location that is etc subfolder in Windows System32 drivers folder of C volume. Again asking about administrator permissions, press continue. Now it's time to test the changes. Again open any web browser and try to open Facebook again. A message appears stating that web page is not available. Let's try to open some other website for example twitter.com. Twitter.com is not blocked. The login page appears in front of you. I try to open it in Internet Explorer. Type facebook.com in address bar. Internet Explorer replies with error message. Because we redirected www.facebook.com to this computer. And this computer is not a web server of facebook.com. 
In this video, we learned a trick of how to block websites on our Windows 7 computers or laptops. You can also use the same trick on Windows 8 or Windows XP. If you like this video, don't forget to press like button. And to get latest videos information in your mailbox, subscribe to my channel. That's all in this video. Thanks for watching.